Why do you want to work out? What is your goal? The most important thing is that you have a vision, that you have a goal. Because without that vision and without that goal, again, you're drifting around and you're never going to end up anywhere. People don't become successful just by accident. Okay, guys, you guys don't, you like, you only have like a few free weights around your house. This is how to grow, grow your biceps. So basically, these are outside curls, which ironically work the inside of your bicep. So basically, you curl outward with the weight. And you put it into your, basically your chest and your side of your lat. So it's a great way to develop your biceps for thickness in your biceps, like width, like width thickness. So it's an amazing way, I find. And then we have two third curls, which create a nice round effect of your biceps, which you don't, you know, right, you see how I'm not going all the way down, I'm only going halfway down, or two thirds down, which creates a lot of tension on your biceps, which basically is you're pushing your biceps in closer. So, it's a great way of creating width in your biceps. Then we have concentration curls. Everyone wants huge, massive peaks when you guys do the double biceps. So basically put it against your leg and curl upwards at like a little bit of a slanted angle and it works your peaks to grow them into what you want in your double biceps. Then we have close grip curls which work the outside of your biceps. It's basically like an outside curl but it reverse the effects and reverse what you're doing so you're curling inside just like the name does and it's great for developing the outside of your biceps. Then we have uh, hammer curls, where you grab horizontally instead of vertically. No, I mean vertically instead of horizontally. And it creates, it works on your sh shoulders and both your middle of your bicep and the side of your bicep. 